We're doing our What's in the Medicine Chest tonight. And I've been asked to do Facebook Live, so hello out there if you're going to join us. This is a very short class, but please reply to the video so that we'll be able to tell if you've attended. And I'll be glad to mail you your class gift. Before we get started, I want to show you some of my references. I used this. Then this is our essential oils reference. You can also use it with the animals. And then I have this really good book that's called the Integrative Medical Guide. So it's got all kinds of behind the scenes information in it about Young Living and Essential Oils. Everyone gets a kit tonight. This is your little first aid kit. I'm not going to give you any oils, but I'm giving you the things to make. Like you will get some capsules to put your oils in because we're going to talk about that. You'll get some little dropper bottles. What else we got in here? I have some Dremels to put the little oils in. I've seen those before. Little spray bottles. A squeeze bottle. This is really cool. This you can put a little salve in. You're going to If you do not have this, this is the pocket, pocket reference of the really big book I just showed you. This is where a lot of information is. So I'm trying to tell y'all where I got this from. Okay, let's see. I have focused on a lot of the basic oils because that's stuff people have on hand. And if you've heard this before, great. If not, oh, and y'all will be talking about this stuff. Look, everybody's sitting here going, okay, no problem. I know this. So, yes, I have these photocopied for you. Lavender is my go-to oil. And if I were to put anything in one of those little dropper bottles, it would be one of them would be lavender. Lavender is great for sunburn, bug bites. It takes away stings. Um, Burns on stoves. Um, I don't know if any of y'all saw Lori. She uh, is a friend of mine in Lexington, and she picked up something hot, and she mixed lavender, frankincense, and coconut. Put all three of those together, and continually put it on frequently, and two hours. There was no burn mark, no swelling, and no blister. That to me is amazing. It's healing and soothing, and of course, it's relaxing. But here are some of the things that it can take away from. You can use the Neosporin, Advil, Tylenol.
Yeah. 